It's Brooke and Jeffrey in the morning. Even more cringy than watching your parents make out at your great grandmother's wake. Oh, it's what? this segment, What's on Your Mind? <laughs> where my parents could taste what was on each other's minds. Oh, but here, yeah. we just go around the room yeah. and we ask Stop. what each member of the show has yeah. been thinking Don't about start lately. Us because you're scarred. Oh, do you want to do it the make out no. way? Because we can do it that way. No. All right, I'm just going to ask then, Brooke. <laughs> What's been on your mind? Okay. Well, my sweet, kind-hearted, loving husband okay. wanted to do <laughs> something special with just him and the kids for the holidays. Like a, a daddy night, right? And how Aww. did he let you down this time? <laughs> yeah, we're waiting for it. Well, his idea was a little questionable. Okay. 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 Because he he's like, I, I want to teach the kids the spirit of Christmas. Oh, so, they should right, learn it. Great, right? Yeah. So his idea that he pitched me was, how about this? Uh-huh. You know, in our neighborhood, there's quite a few homeless people, unfortunately, and yeah. many of them live in in RVs along the road. Okay, right? She's dated half of them. Yeah. So yeah. Ex boyfriend Rose, yeah. what we call yeah. it. <laughs> and so his idea was to take our children, seven and four years old, at night. No. With. Wait, with, I already don't like this. With Brooke. fifteen pizzas and have them knock on the RV doors oh. and surprise the people with. Cheese pizza. Okay. That's kind of a nice it thought. Kind of sweet. What's wrong with that? Uh, yeah, who knows what they're doing <laughs> at, night. at night in an RV <laughs> with a four year old. Well, you yeah. can't give them pizza for breakfast. I mean, <laughs> right. When are, when are they supposed <laughs> to eat? Point, it? That, that I, I, I told them no, that yeah. that's maybe not the best thought out plan. <laughs> Daddy, and that there's, there's weird smells coming from <laughs> this RV. Oh, yeah, yeah. Find the smoke, kids. And that there's reasons that there's whole organizations set up to provide this type of service to people because it's not something that you should just go out and do on your own. Yeah. Oh, okay. So your idea is knock on the vans and be like, hey, move it down over to the shelter. (laughs) You're blocking the area where my children play. I mean, there's probably a better idea to teach them how to be charitable than to be knocking on RV doors at at night (laughs) with pizza and surprising people. (laughs) Okay. And so so if anybody has a better idea, that would be great for me so that I can... If there's already a shelter that's feeding people, go while they're feeding people so they can help hand it out at the appropriate time, not in like a sketchy corner of your neighborhood. Thank you, Jose, for understanding. (laughs) I don't know why you thought this was a good idea too, Well, no. In the meantime, for all the homeless people living near Brooke's house, you're going hungry. (laughs) You're going hungry. Figure it out. We're not helping you. Figure it out. I mean, the thought was good. The execution... I okay. give it an F. It needs a little. Oh, yeah. Right. Yeah. <laughs> Brooke's like, you can go, but I'll slash all the RV tires. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> so That's what I'm saying. Us. That makes sense. <laughs> Jose, what's been on your mind? Well, over the weekend, I went out to dinner with a really close friend of mine and his fiance. Okay. Mm-hmm. And at one point in the dinner, my buddy asked if his fiance and I, if his fiance and I could get a pic because we're sitting next to each other. Okay. Yeah, so okay. he's like, hey guys, get close and we take a pic. Nice. Then fast forward to later that night, I see that online that he had posted it. Cute. On Instagram. So I was yeah. like, oh, cool. So I reposted it to my story, yeah. which yeah. I often do when I'm tagged and stuff. Right. Yeah, that's nice. So like an hour later, I start getting messages. One from a girl that I that I flirted with before, like recently. Yeah. And she's mm-hmm. like, wow, I'm mad at you. What? I was like, what? what? And then another person says, hey, cute couple. Congratulations. Oh, no. Oh. And I go, oh. no. And I realize people think that I was on a date with her. You didn't give just... any, like, context in your post? No, I just shared it my buddy posted it and we were eating shrimp chips Uh, it's like a couple of shrimp chips and i'm like hey that's me were you lading in the tramping the shrimp no not at all (laughs) just a normal picture (laughs) totally okay are they a couple that maybe want to invite you in is that their invitation i've never been asked okay but all i'm saying is i'm like well should i take it down and i'm like no she's just a friend like right you know i'm gonna leave it up so i left it up i went to bed Mm -hmm. then i woke up to a bunch more messages. How many oh, women no. are you? No, men too. My guy friends are like, dude, congrats. Like, you <laughs> finally are dating. And I'm like, no. <laughs> oh, like, oh. No, no. So I literally felt like my own PR person. And I had to like make a statement <laughs> yeah, to the public you here. Did. Okay. So I made a video and posted video it statement. to remind mm. everybody I'm very single. I'm okay. very lonely. Yeah, and feel the, free to hit okay. on me. Okay. It just remember sad, like sadder. Yeah. Like I'm not taking the fake girlfriend. Yeah. Honestly. I know, but it's like you know that I can't wait to go to their wedding. Yeah. So I'm not okay. gonna own any of this. I'm like, no, I'm, she's definitely taken. And either that know. or you just use it to your advantage. Like, yeah, you want some yeah. of this too. <laughs> that is true. I mean, I had a lot of cute girls that I never talked to that were like, oh, I'm mad at you. Yeah. I'm like, oh well, okay then. Okay. Anyway, I figure from now on, I'm just gonna post. 
pictures of myself all alone at restaurants. No, that's not. <laughs> I think sad. that's the next strategy. Okay. Is, so this whole, this whole thing is just to let everybody know that, yes, you are still single and you're yeah, willing to meet pretty people. much, yes. That was and what this, this entire thing was a setup I for. I did not that's mean right. to block myself. Okay. 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 Right. You know, what kind of block myself? Yeah. Um, I am single. So okay. free to hit on me. That was my friend's fiance. Okay. And everything's going to be okay. All yeah. right. Thank God. Jose. Oh, yeah. Thank God. Your own worst enemy. Social media Always. coordinator Alexis, tell us what's been on your mind. So, you guys, I'm jealous of my mom. Oh. Yeah. What? My Why? mom. About what? She came to visit me recently, but she came later than expected because she got invited to a big Christmas party. Uh-huh. Okay. Ooh. And I see the photos, you guys, and she's like a sleazy Santa. Like, oh, nice. She's in like knee high boots, a skirt that barely covers her, oh, open chest, yeah. everything. What's are you, up? are you two like switching? Roles? Like, are you like actually policing her wardrobe? Thing, I'm literally sitting in my house on my couch on Saturday night, and I'm looking at my mom out at a Christmas party like You're that, at home. and I'm waiting for her to come visit me. <laughs> Does your mom, perchance, want to come work for our radio station? Yeah. Yeah. She'd love to come on here. Oh, but, I would okay. love to meet your mom. And then it's like she gets to visit me, and we go out to drinks, and she gets drunker than I do. Oh. So I'm driving us home from drinks. So your mom's the cool one? Yeah, I guess so. She's telling me all about a trip to Hawaii. She just went on. Where oh. a guy paid for the entire trip for her, guys. Oh. Okay. Funded so the entire trip. Oh. She's living your best life. No, she yeah. really, really is. is. She really is. And I hear her listen to all her New Year's plans and how she can't pick which one. Oh. And I'm like, oh, no. okay, I don't have that issue at all. So <laughs> I, I don't know what to do. Like, and she's like, by the way, can I borrow a crop top? Yeah, no, for yeah. real. <laughs> and she would probably look better in it right now. Oh. And I just, I haven't been this jealous since, like, you dyed your hair pink over. Oh. You know what I mean? Like, I don't know what to do when hey. my mom is living my life. I think you bring your mom around me more. That's what oh, I do. No. No. <laughs> she I think she feels, restaurants with me. No, I think she feels the same I do oh, yeah. about that. Uh, about yeah. that. Grossed out? Okay. <laughs> but yeah, guys, it's um, tough. It's tough. Yeah. Jeffrey, what's on your mind? Well, I had a, a really embarrassing moment the other night. Oh, no. um, so, did you guys know that there's a new Matrix movie that's coming out? Yes. Yeah, they're no. promoting yeah. it. There's like a video game coming out. Okay, see, I didn't know that. How did oh, you not yeah. know that? It's like everywhere. Yeah, so, I'm sitting in my living room watching TV with a couple people, and the trailer for the new movie comes on, yeah. and mm-hmm. I geek out so hard. Oh. I think the first like the first look at it was like months ago. I didn't know right? about that. Sure. This was the first time okay. I saw it and I never get excited about stuff like yeah. ever. No, you don't. But okay. I am sitting there <laughs> just losing my mind. I'm like, <gasps> "Oh <Neo>! my god, <laughs> what?" <laughs> What is this? And I'm screaming at the TV. I'm like, oh my God, Morpheus. Oh my God, is that Trinity? She's back, Trinity. And there's like tears welling up in my eyes. I'm squealing in my chair. I yelled at somebody to shut up so I could hear it better. This is important. And then the trailer ends. And then there's that moment of like everything calms down and that realization dawns on me of just how stupid I've been acting for the last 30 seconds Uh over a movie trailer. Yeah. Because there's been hundreds of sequels that have come out over the last few years, and I've never been excited for anything no. like that. Like, that was my childhood. Yeah, no, I'm stoked for it, too, yeah. but not, like, I'm a embarrass little... <laughs> myself in front of a group of people. Yeah. I, I'm a little disappointed. I posted that trailer, like, on our, our Brooke and Jeffrey our website. <laughs> I mean, <laughs> how long ago, Jake? A couple months ago? Jake's I don't even know. Yeah. So thanks for months. checking out our website. Yeah. yeah. No, I've never been to it, but I hear it's pretty nice. <laughs> okay. You're on it's it. it. <laughs> yeah, but, uh, but Matrix Resurrections. Yeah. December 22nd, yeah. I'm getting my leather outfit back out. Okay. And wow. I'm going to see yeah. that thing in theaters. I would clear the theater Please, out. please <laughs> don't wear a leather outfit. <laughs> <laughs> You're going to get kicked out. Yeah. Oh, anyway, text also, in. Also, your leather outfit's more like a cat woman. Yeah. yeah. you know. Text in to 78592. Tell us what's been on your mind. It's Brooke and Jeffrey in the morning.